for me, it's the knowing and the not knowing when it comes to being a single mom. It's the knowing and the not knowing that makes it so difficult at times when it comes to being a single mom. Your children have so much that they want to come home and bring to you and they have so much information that they want to share with you and it's so overwhelming at times because it's just you. You know, you have to feed them, you have to clothe them, you have to be involved in their life, you have to be involved in your life. And depending on how much children you have, it's a situation that you have to literally learn how to balance. And so, to all of my single moms, single parenting homes, I get it. I raised my daughters, they're over 30 years old now, and I'm helping my oldest daughter currently to raise her daughter single parently unfortunately this is a trend i don't know what it is but i tell you what us women are strong we're powerful we're able to do all things but fail with christ that is in us looking at my life and seeing where god has brought me from truly i can sit here and testify to all single parenting homes i am a proud grandmother i am a proud mother I'm 50 years old. I think I still look good. I have my self-care moments. I, I do everything in life that I need to do. And I never just gave up on me. I never gave up on me. My baby daddy probably gave up on me. My husband gave up on me. My husbands gave up on me because they didn't love me enough. But guess what? I'm so glad that I loved me enough. I showed up for me. And I had the common sense enough to know that there was a higher power that can truly help me. And that is Jesus Christ himself. To God be the glory.